हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू दिस वीडियो इन दिस वीडियो का क्वेश्चन इज फाइंड द अमाउंट एंड द कंपाउंड इंटरेस्ट ऑन रुपीस फाइव थाउजेंड पर टू इयर्स एट सिक्स परसेंट पर एनम इंटरेस्ट पेबल इयरली सो दिस इज द क्वेश्चन सो ना सर्विस सो दिस क्वेश्चन में विद विद द कंपाउंड इंटरेस्ट फॉर्मूला सो फर्स्ट वे राइट दैट इन द क्वेश्चन इट इज गिवन द प्रिंसिपल दिस इक्वल टू रुपीस फाइव थाउजेंड गिवन द रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट इ so that rate is equal to six percent per annum, and time will be equal to. So in the simple interest formula, we used to take time as one year, but we will, but in the compound interest, we will do the you know, time as two years only. We will take it directly. So time is equal to two years. So now we will uh, write our formula like this. That therefore the amount is equal to. The formula is principal into bracket one plus. R by hundred or the rate by hundred to the power n, where n is the number uh, number of years. So we put the values. The principal is five thousand into right bracket one plus R by six percent per annum. So by hundred to the power two as n is equal to two. So if we solve this, we will get the amount at the end of two years. So five thousand we write. So now I will. Uh, Now solve the inside for inside of the bracket first. So we take hundred as the as total as the now one into hundred hundred plus six square is equal to five thousand into so it become one hundred six by hundred. Now two to the power two a square means we have to write this number two times. Then one hundred six into one hundred six by hundred into one hundred six by hundred. Uh, we, it means that one hundred six by hundred square. So now I solve this. So first we cut the zeros. So now, so now it means that five into one hundred six into one hundred six by ten. So we are taking uh, taking the ten as for convenient. It will be easy to you know, put the decimal point. So first we added one hundred six into one hundred six. That is five into. So for this, the one hundred six into one hundred six, we will use a trick. So for that trick, first we write that six six. So what is six into six? That is thirty six. You all know. So now in one hundred six, it is six times greater than hundred. One hundred six is six times greater than hundred. So we will add six to one hundred six. So it becomes one hundred twelve. So we write one hundred twelve. So one hundred six into one hundred six become. Eleven thousand two hundred thirty-six. So it will only become one hundred six. Now five into ten by hundred. So now I can easily write five hundred. So five into eleven thousand two hundred thirty-six. It becomes fifty-six thousand one hundred eighty. So now now by ten. So by ten, that means we will just cut the zeros. So it means rupees five thousand six hundred eighteen. So therefore, this is the amount that is at the end of two years. So now our final statement that we have to find out the compound interest. So therefore, write the compound interest is equal to the formula is amount minus principal. So amount is five thousand six hundred eighteen minus our principal that is five thousand. So it becomes rupees six hundred eighteen. So therefore, our amount for this question is five thousand six hundred eighty, and our compound interest is six hundred eighty. So this is our final answer for this question. So guys, thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel for more, more solution.